Now to your top 10 headlines in just two minutes. A Florida sheriff's deputy and driver, lucky to be alive. They were sucked into a flooded storm drain during a torrential downpour. Both were dragged underwater for around 30 seconds before re-emerging, soaked but unharmed, on the other side of the highway. President Biden's son, Hunter, pleaded guilty to misdemeanor federal tax offenses. He's also expected to reach an agreement with federal prosecutors on a felony charge of possession of a firearm as a drug user. Experts say the deal will likely keep him out of prison. President Biden's three-day Northern California visit continued today in the Bay Area. Ahead of fundraisers tonight, the president met with leaders in the fast-growing field of AI to talk benefits and risks of the new technology. At least 41 women have died during a riot at a women's prison in Honduras. Most of the women burned to death. Others were shot. The headquarters of the Paris 2024 Olympic Organizing Committee raided by police today. They're investigating allegations of embezzlement of public funds, among other charges. Actor Jonathan Major's domestic violence case will go to trial August 3rd. Majors is charged with several misdemeanors, accused of twisting a woman's arm, striking her head, and shoving her into a vehicle in New York City in March. His lawyer says he's innocent. Placer County's Board of Supervisors has approved an environmental impact report and conditional use permit for a proposed new winery in Penryn. Most speakers at today's hearing were in favor, but some were worried about the size of the tower that will offer visitors views of the vineyard. The Great Resignation showing no signs of stopping. A recent survey shows a quarter of workers plan to change jobs in the next 12 months. That's up from 19% last year. Swaths of insects known as Mormon crickets have taken over homes, roads, and the local hospital in Elk, Nevada. It's the expansion of a cricket crisis that started a few weeks ago in Idaho. State transportation officials are using plows and are warning of slick roads due to all the squashed bugs. A scary scene as a door flew open on board a Brazilian plane shortly after takeoff. The plane was carrying members of a band. The good news is no one was hurt and the plane returned to the airport for an emergency landing. And those are your top 10 headlines in just two minutes.